there everyone welcome back to my channel today we're diving into a topic that's been highly requested the ugly truth about PSW or personal support worker jobs now before we get started I want to clarify that this video is not meant to discourage anyone from pursuing a career as a PSW. Instead, it's about shedding light on some of the challenges that come with this important and often underappreciated profession. Job Demands one of the first things we need to discuss is the demanding nature of the job. PSW play a critical role in providing care to individuals who are often vulnerable and in need of assistance. This means you'll be dealing with a range of tasks, including bathing, dressing, feeding, and sometimes even palliative care. It can be physically and emotionally draining. Low pay. One of the unfortunate aspects of being a PSW is the relatively low pay. Despite the immense responsibility and emotional labor involved in the job. PSWs are often underpaid. This can make it challenging to make a comfortable living, especially if you have a family to support. Lack of recognition. PSWs are the unsung heroes of the healthcare system. They work tirelessly, yet their efforts often go unrecognized. This lack of acknowledgement can be disheartening, leading to burnout and prostration. Emotional Tool The emotional tool of the job cannot be underestimated. PSWs often form close bonds with their clients, which can be emotionally taxing, especially when they witness the decline in the client's health or even their passing. Coping with these emotional challenges is a significant part of the job. Limited Advancement Another issue is the limited opportunities for career advancement. PSWs may feel stuck in their roles with few opportunities for growth or career progression. This lack of upward mobility can be discouraging for those who want to develop their careers in healthcare. Lack of resources. PSWs often work in challenging conditions with limited resources, adequate staffing, proper training, and essential supplies can be in short supply, making the job even more difficult. In conclusion, the life of a PSW is incredibly rewarding, but it comes with its fair share of challenges. Low pay, emotional strain, and lack of recognition are just a few of the difficulties they face. However, it's essential to remember that PSWs are the backbone of the healthcare industry, providing vital care to
to those who need in the most. If you're considering a career as a PSW, it's important to weigh the pros and cons, but also keep in mind the profound difference you can make in the lives of your clients. It's a job that requires a big heart and a strong will. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like and share and subscribe for more insightful content. Before we wrap up, I want to hear from all of you if you're a PSW or have experience working in the field. Please share your thoughts and insights in the comments below. Your perspective is invaluable and it can be provide support and encouragement to those who are considering a career as a PSW. Remember, every profession has its challenges and being a PSW is no exception. However, the satisfaction of knowing you've made a positive impact on someone's life can be incredibly rewarding. It's a career that requires dedication, compassion, and resilience. Thank you for joining me in this discussion about the ugly truth about PSW or personal support worker jobs. If you find this video informative, please give it a thumbs up, share it with others who might benefit, and subscribe for more content on various career and life topics. Take care and I'll see you in the next video. I've been lying here for too long I don't know what else to do I wanna get away from every little thing Just to try to make it through Thinking about my options Every detail in my head But it doesn't really matter Nothing matters so I cry instead I've been running circles Trying to catch my breath I've been trying Staring at the ceiling I've been staying up all night Everything I ever worked for Vanished in the blink of an eye I've been asking every question Cause I haven't got a clue Why's it gotta be me? What the hell am I supposed to do? I've been trying